Welcome back to the show. While so many people are stuck working at home, including almost all of our entire staff, uh, we wanted to check in with some of our friends of DBL and see how they're doing. So right now, we are going live to the home of our wonderfully good friend, the host of Entertainment Tonight, Kevin Frazier. Kevin in the building. How you doing man? today? Hey, Kevin. <laughs> how are you? That wasn't cool. Uh, Kevin, how are you and your family doing? And tell me how you guys are passing the time. Um, things are good i mean my oldest son his school was on top of it so he has been in front of a computer 24 7. my youngest son um that's been a little bit of a, a challenge he <laughs> the struggle is real with him and he misses his friends of course but um you know other than that we've been inside the house my wife is a lawyer she's trying to keep her practice going that is my youngest son right there you see i said dude is struggling with the <laughs> shutdown and you see everybody in their different corners of the oh, house yeah, doing to. their own thing it's very interesting when we're here for three meals a day together. Ooh. Like so many Americans, you're finding out that, number one, teachers need to be paid more, a lot more. Yes. Uh, number two, all of us in the same house all the time, your house gets really small really fast. <laughs> Kevin, I appreciate you saying that about teachers. I taught seventh grade middle school for five years, so I, I completely you feel know. you on that. Yes, and I also, by the way, I follow you on Instagram, and I saw the salami prank <laughs> where your son uh, put that piece of salami in your head, and I didn't read the caption at first, and I was like, did he fall asleep eating a sandwich? <laughs> no, I fell asleep, and my kids put salami on my head <laughs> while I was asleep. I couldn't believe, like, I woke up, and I was going through my phone, and I was like, wait, wait a minute. Where's that picture? That's a good you prank. put salami on my head? That's a good and they're prank. dying. So it's going to be prank city in my house right now. Yes. But you know what? I do, I do want to say that, hey, it's great to have time with family. But remember, even though the kids want to play with their friends, they have to keep a distance because yeah. this virus is very, very serious. So look, as much as they complain, find things to do together as a family and kind of try to keep them away from their friends. They could well, polish the Emmys that I see on the top <laughs> right over there. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Don't worry, don't worry. Your guy, Chris Clark, has a couple of those too. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now, now, Kevin, speaking of distance. He got us though. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> I'm gonna ask you this, Kevin, speaking of distance, how is E.T., uh, your show, like adjusting to all this craziness? Well, you know, what's funny is that um, just before this, I was shooting some of um, our leads and tags for today's show from my kitchen. Um, the ET studio now is the Frazier household and everybody's going live. This was one of the last days that we were able to um, go live. And that's me trying to be sexy man in my turn. But anyway, this, <laughs> this was one of the last days that we were actually in the studio, but our whole studio complex is shut down. So we can't go back in. We would love to go back in if we could, but we can't. And wow. we're taking this very, very serious like everybody else. And if you're at home, you can still work. And so we are at home. Kudos to y'all for being in the studio. Kudos for y'all um, uh, working through this entire thing and bringing a little joy to everybody. We're you know, trying. People need a distraction right now. Yes, a and bit. that's what I was known for, a distraction. <laughs> uh, I want to ask you this, Kevin. Do you think celebrities are helping or hurting? Because let's talk about like the Imagine video where they sang and people it really rubbed people the wrong way. Is it helpful or hurtful during this pandemic? Well, I, I would say this. I think that everything is up to everybody's opinion, but I, I thought D-Nice um, oh. going live and being live for five days straight, 100,000 people joining him, my wife dancing around Me the too. kitchen and living room, um, then out in the street um, looking at her friends and John Legend going live with Chrissy and singing. These are things that are entertaining people, and I support those folks. I mean, the fact that Arnold had those baby horse, those little horses in his house and he was feeding them, I'm worried about that. I'm concerned. Um, and then Madonna, these kinds of things to me are fun and yeah. they're distractions once again for everybody who's inside and stir crazy and losing their minds. Kudos to all these stars that are doing this. And I say, you know, Bring it on. Bring the it more, on. The Mario. Rosie O'Donnell saying she might do her show now I because, know. you know, she might bring her show back. Well, cheers to you, too. Kudos to you, Kevin. Thank you so much for being with us. We will be right back. Thanks, Kev. I like those Emmys. Thanks, yeah. guys. See you all soon. Bye, love.